All right, we have the brand new PolySync 40. This is a wireless Bluetooth or USB speakerphone that you can use for your huddle rooms or your meetings with about five to 10 people. In this video, we're gonna show you what this speakerphone's all about and of course, test the speaker and microphone so you can hear and be the judge for yourself how this speakerphone sounds. Hey everyone, my name is David. This is the Channel Headset Advisor where we review and compare all of the latest business technology, such as your headsets, speaker phones, and video conferencing devices. So hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out on future videos just like this one. All right, so let's get started and see what's inside the box. So as we see here, we have our quick start guide. We have the speaker phone, and that is all we got. So, let us take a look at this device here. Here you go. So it has a USB cable that's on the bottom here that unwinds. Then you got maybe, you know, three to five feet for this cable here. And then you have some touch sensitive screen here. This is a lot like the other PolySync devices we've done a review on, the PolySync 20, which is the smaller version. This is the medium size version, which is the PolySync 40. Then you have the big version, which is PolySync uh, 60. So this is a wireless speaker phone. It's decent size for a wireless speaker phone and we're gonna see how it sounds here in just a second. What's unique about this particular model is that it is a fully wireless uh, speaker phone and you can actually pair up a second uh, PolySync 40. So you can get two fully wireless speaker phones going on on your conference, all paired up to your uh, computer, your laptop, through that USB dongle or even your mobile phone. So pair this up to your mobile phone and add a second PolySync 40. Now, uh, I don't have a, poly, a secondary PolySync, so I can't test that on this video, but I do have a PolySync 60 that has the same feature. So I'm gonna test that out later on in this video to see if I can actually pair up both of those devices together and show you what it sounds like. But this is a Bluetooth speaker phone. So if you have a small, conference room two to five people i'd say typically is how this should be used but you might be able to use up to about 10 people especially if you get that second polysync 40 uh, device so that you could lay down both devices in a conference room and have that 10 plus people conversation what i like is that it's completely wireless and it's larger than all the other typical wireless speaker phones such as you know the PolySync 20, which is almost half the size of this, or some of the other brands that look like a hockey puck. And you know, it's just a fraction of the size and it gave you a fraction of the uh, audio quality. So let's get uh, to testing this speaker phone. We're gonna plug it in so that you can hear how this speaker and microphone sounds on this PolySync 40. All right, so before we get to testing the speaker here, I wanna talk about some of the specs here real quick. So this is a Bluetooth wireless speaker phone or a wireless speaker phone for that matter. It has 30 hours of continuous talk time on one full charge, which is quite a bit of battery life, which is really impressive. And then it also is a, a battery bank for you know whatever USB device you're trying to charge. But the primary application that I would imagine is plug in to your cell phone. So your cell phone's charging while you're on a conference call so your phone doesn't die while you're in the middle of a meeting. So it's nice to have that extra little bit of power to kind of preserve you in a situation that you might have your cell phone out and you're trying to have a long meeting and your phone's starting to die. Simply plug it in and you're good to go with that extra battery life, which is convenient. You also have this rocket ship button which you can customize to do a variety of things, Microsoft Teams, uh, you could do you know, Bluetooth pairing mode. There's a variety of options that you can adjust in the Poly software. And one option I really like is the pairing button. So you can pair up two PolySync 40s together, which is a huge advantage. And then you have a 
LED light that's built into here so you can tell when you're on a call whether you've muted your microphones or not. And speaking of microphones, there's actually three microphones built in here so that you're gonna be able to have your voice be heard no matter what side of the conference phone that you're actually on. So uh, that is the technical specs here. So let's get to the fun stuff and test out the speaker and see how it sounds. All right, so now we have this SYNC 40 connected to the computer via the USB cable. And I have this decibel reader here so you can get an idea of how loud the volume is coming out of this speaker. And also I speak at about 75 decibels so you can get an idea of kind of how loud this speaker is. What we're gonna do first is play uh, just a Zoom meeting conference so you can get an idea of how well the audio quality is as far as a meeting is gonna go because that's a likely scenario that you're gonna use this speakerphone for is a meeting. So, and then we're gonna go to music after that. So Jessica, if you could start the meeting. Understand how these are put together in terms of structure. Now in Texas, um, they don't make it as straightforward as Louisiana. So you have both readiness standards as well as particular skill standards. And a lot of people think all oh, we have to teach is the skill all standards. Right, stop. But in reality, and then go ahead and play the music. All right, that sound quality was absolutely fantastic. It was louder uh, than 85 decibels and a lot of that. And the music, just for you know how compact this speaker is, it just sounded great, good range in bass, and then also great you know highs, so you can cr uh, crystal clear hear those video meetings and conversations that you're having, as well as hearing good quality music. So what we're gonna do next is we're gonna test out the microphone, but before we do that, I just wanna let you know that this speakerphone is available on our website. Uh, MSRP of this model is $299, but make sure you use coupon code YouTube, all one word. The link will be in the video description as well as up on your screen, just so you know. All right, so let's get to testing out the microphone. I'm gonna test it when it's hooked up via wired connection like we have right now and then also test it when it's connected via Bluetooth. And then I'm gonna see if we can actually connect this to the big version of this, the Sync 60, to see if that works. So let's get started. All right, so uh, my voice is coming through the camera right now. So this is what it sounds like through the DSLR camera. Now we're switching to the PolySync 40. Now my voice is directly being recorded on this speakerphone here. So this is what it sounds like and this room is uh, a private office and this is what it would sound like when there's not much you know noises and, and distractions in a meeting room there is some cars and other stuff in uh you know outside the building here but in this room it's relatively quiet so this is what you can expect your voice to sound like when it comes through this speakerphone and it's uh hooked up again via usb cable so this is going to be the best sound quality and i'm just going to walk around so you can see how well the pickup of the microphones goes. It's rated up to eight feet away. So let me stand here in the corner. Now I'm in the far corner of the room and I'm still talking how I normally talk. And this is about eight feet away. I'm just gonna kind of walk around here. So testing one, two, three. This is what it sounds like at this corner of the speakerphone. And there are three microphones built in to the speakerphone. So it's constantly trying to adjust how you sound as far as when you step away. Now I'm going to step towards the camera, which is like 10 to 15 feet away. And this is what it sounds like at 10 to 15 feet. All right. Now let me just walk back here so you can get an idea of how well this speakerphone sounds when it's hooked up to a Bluetooth connection. All right, so now my voice is being recorded directly through this speakerphone, and look at that. This is completely wireless now. It has this blue fancy uh, icon here that shows you that your Bluetooth connection is there, as well as those LED lights that are on both sides of the speaker so you know you're on a call. And it's just really nice being able to have this completely wireless because now I can just 
kind of walk around here and and speak with this speakerphone and have a full conference. So you can move this to another room, another location, pair it up to your mobile phone, and you're just 100% mobile. And again, that's up to 30 hours of continuous talk time. And this is a full duplex uh, speakerphone, which just means that you're not going to have choppy audio at all. So it's going to be a nice conversation. So this is what it sounds like when it's on uh, the wireless connection. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to try to connect this up to the PolySync 60 and see if that's even possible. So let's try it out. All right, so we have all of the PolySync devices here in front of us. We have the PolySync 20, we have the PolySync 40, and we have the PolySync 60. So this is just the size difference. So obviously the 20 is if you are in a small personal environment, maybe you're working from home, maybe you're on the go, that type of thing, you can take this with you on the go. But we don't need that because this you cannot pair up to any other devices. It's just a standalone device. So we're gonna put that down and away. Now the question is, uh, I know you can do two PolySync 40s together, pair them up, and it's very simple. You just uh, hold this button here that's this, uh, got a little link icon, and you just click and hold that, put it into pairing mode, and then you would do that for the other PolySync 40. So I'm gonna do that, but I'm gonna see if it'll work on the PolySync 60, as I know you can do the same feature with the uh, PolySync 60. So let's go ahead and do that. Connecting. It says connecting, I'm gonna go to the 60, and I'm gonna do the same thing. Connecting. I'm gonna guess that this works fully, but we'll see. And they have these lights kind of lighting up here on the side. Not sure if you can see that. And just so you know, they're both up to date um, through all the tests, the speaker tests, the microphone tests. These have been up to date through the hub. So um, there's not that concern here. So uh, it's not pairing up. When I did this on the Sync 60, it paired up very quickly. So that leads me to believe this is probably not gonna work out here but it's just a fun experiment nonetheless. So we're gonna give it a few more seconds here, see if it'll pair up. Man, I really, would, if I was betting, I was gonna assume that this was gonna work. Uh, same brand, same technology, same way they do it, but uh, apparently they know better. Polly knows that people are gonna try to do things like this, so uh, looks like it's not going to work. So that's a bummer, so uh, that would have been cool. Regardless, uh, you get the idea here is you would have two PolySync 40 devices. And what I like about the PolySync 40, especially versus the 60, is this is a fully wireless speakerphone. You're going to be able to have two of them so that you can have more people in your conference room. So it just enhances the audio as far as you know, how loud and how clear everybody can hear the conversations. I don't know if you've been around somebody who ends up taking the speakerphone and trying to listen to what's going on. Whereas if you have two fully wireless speakerphones right next to each other, it's going to be a lot louder and more people are going to be able to hear the meeting a lot more clearly. And then, of course, everybody's voice, since there's microphones built into um, the PolySync 40, since there's three of them, you, you would have six microphones now, so your voice would be picked up from so many different angles, which is really cool technology. Haven't seen that before, so really cool. So that was an experiment gone wrong, but at least we tried it out and you saw it for yourself here. All right, so there's the microphone and the testing. What did you think of the overall performance of PolySync 40? Put your thoughts in the comment section below. Overall, I found this conference phone to be uh, very unique. What I like is that it's a fully wireless, larger speakerphone, and that you can also daisy chain. So if you need more microphones and speakers because this one isn't enough for the amount of people that you have in the room, you can double it up. So you can have double the amount of speakers and microphones, and it can really enhance the audio experience for your conference calls and it's a 100% wireless. So I really like that. And then you have 30 hours of talk time. So it's going to cover you for quite some time. 
there's so many different scenarios that you could use uh, you know the polysync 40 for so I really liked it the uh, audio quality was fantastic I really loved the audio quality especially from a device that's not huge but it's not small either so I, I really like it overall if you're looking for a speaker phone that you're going to be able to connect to have your audio calls for zoom for Skype for Ring Central, Zoom, uh, Microsoft Teams, any of those type of platforms that you use on the computer or a mobile phone, this is going to allow you to have an awesome audio experience. So definitely worth considering. So if you're interested, again, uh, the Sync 40 starts at $299.99. And if you use coupon code YouTube, all one word, that's gonna get you the best discount on this speakerphone on our website. So check it out there. And then you can get the 40 plus, which just means it includes that uh, Bluetooth USB dongle. So then you can wirelessly pair this up to the computer if your computer does not have that Bluetooth dongle. So you wanna get the Sync 40 plus version, which just means it has that little USB dongle. So that's all. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit that thumbs up button and don't forget to hit that subscribe. So I also think if you're interested in this product, you're gonna like this video here on the best headset, Bluetooth headset of 2021. So check that out right there. Other than that, really appreciate you coming by and watching this video. Thanks a lot and we will see you next time.